What's up guys? We are off to Jazz Fest! Yay! We are in the car with a lot of humans and we are super excited. Ah! Let me tell you. She likes driving. <laughs> <laughs> Goddamn terrified. So I'm gonna keep this camera down until we get to Jazz Fest. Okay! I love you guys. Enjoy the video! Finally, we made it to Safaricom Jazz Fest. Today is going to be kind of a different video. I want to give you kind of like a 360 of what encompasses in jazz. So there's from the ghetto classics and the amazing things that Safaricom is doing to help the kids in the different communities, bringing them up with the help of music and the amazing music that we're going to Alexia is behind the camera. <laughs> So yeah, here we go. Let's go listen to some amazing jazz music. Woo! If you do not know what the Safaricom Jazz Festival is, I don't know what truck you've been living under because this is the highlight of the Kenyan social scene where you get to enjoy good music, you get to watch live amazing performances and you get to do it all for a good cause. Hello, can I get a whoop whoop? So, the Safaricom Jazz Festival this year was held at the Carnival Grounds. We were lucky enough to be celebrating the International Jazz Day, which was a pretty cool and a pretty big deal because we got to do it alongside other countries in the world who are also celebrating good music and good vibes. So, the beauty about Safaricom Jazz Festival is that you get to watch all these performances right before your eyes. I remember just a couple of years back watching Gogosimo in Tamasha and I couldn't believe I was watching them on the stage and it was just absolutely phenomenal. I feel like if I looked through my albums, I'd probably find one of their albums that I bought during one of those fun drunk nights that, that I had at Tamasha. But that aside, have you heard of the Ghetto Classics? Oh my goodness. They are one of the most amazing group of children who are so talented and so full of passion for music. They've been provided with an amazing opportunity, an amazing platform. I found out that they even performed for the Pope and the President, which is by far the one of the most amazing things. They have been able to move from where they are. They have been able to learn from that. Even if you come from obscurity, even if you come from a hardship, it doesn't really determine where you're going to go in life. And you can tell this from the way they hold their instruments, from the passion they play with, which is one of the most amazing things. The Ghetto Classics is able to raise money. Just in February, we were able to raise 17 million Kenya shillings, which is by far super amazing. You guys have no idea. When you actually do biotech, you are actually contributing to a child's life, which is a really, really amazing thing. I feel that with the more shows coming up and the more involvement that we have with the community, we can be able to build each and every person. We can, it's, it's time to stop blaming the society and start doing things, which is a really cool thing. Well... I'm going to read more about this on my blog post at uh, jtickerpick.com where you guys can be able to get more information on this. But for now, let's enjoy some music and yeah, I love you guys. 